Hi there, let's do some more math, okay? I really loved seeing you guys with your cylinders showing me that they roll and stack. I even had one friend that showed me that a cylinder can actually do all three things. It can roll, it can stack, and it can slide. It's the only shape that can do all those things. Well, today we're gonna to be talking a little bit more about shapes, but today we're going to talk about the word surface. You know what shape this is. This is a cube, right? The surface is the flat side of the cube. And you see that when I turn it, there's more than one flat side. There's one on this side, there's one on this side, there's one over here. There's many flat surfaces of a cube. Let's look at our cylinder. Does the cylinder have any flat surfaces? Well, here's a flat one, and here's a flat one but this is a curved surface. This is not a flat surface, right? And then we'll also look at the cone. The cone has a flat surface on the bottom. I'm missing my flat surface because I had to make my cone, but there would be a flat surface here. And this is not a flat surface. This is called a point and a curved surface. Last one, the sphere. The sphere has any flat surfaces? Nope. It's not flat no matter which way you turn it. It's always round, curved. It's not, has no flat surfaces. Okay, now that we've got a little idea of what we're doing, let's take a look at what happens next. Okay, here's what we're looking at next. The question on the first page is that we're looking for a solid figure that has a circle as one of the flat surfaces, okay? So let's start up here at the top. This cube, just like my cube, does it have any surfaces that are in the shape of a circle? I don't see any circle shapes. I see only square shapes on my cube. Just like this one, I see a square shape here. And there's a square shape up here on the top and a square shape on the side. There's no, no circle surfaces on a cube. How about on a sphere? Do we have any circle surfaces? Well, we know that a sphere is round, but it doesn't have any flat surfaces. It's round the whole way around. It doesn't have any flat surfaces and none that are circles. Oh, that's another sphere. We can cross off both of the spheres. Oh, and there's another cube. We can cross off both of the cubes. Hmm. Now we've got a co oh, two cones and some cylinders. Well, let's take a look. This cone has the round curved side. What does it have on the bottom? A flat surface. What shape is the flat surface? It's circle. And we're looking for shapes that have a circle for the flat surface. Look at this cone. You guys, I found a, a little toy cone in my uh, toy chest at my house. Look at this little toy cone. It looks like this big one. And on the bottom, it actually looks like it has a square, just like this. It looks like it has a square, except if you look in the middle, what do you see? A circle. There is a circle because it's a cone. It has that circle surface. Last ones, these three cylinders. Does a cylinder have a flat surface that is circular? Well, it has a curved surface right here, and it's got a flat surface on the top and a flat surface on the bottom, and what shape does that look like? Like a circle. So our cylinders all have a circular flat surface. Very good. Right here, number one, they've circled their answers for us. What do you think they're asking? Well, here's a picture of a square, and they circled the two shapes that are cubes. They must have been asking us for the solid shape that has a square surface. Okay, well then on this one, we should be looking for the solid shapes that have a 
circular surface. Let's take a look. What about the cube? Any circular surfaces? Nope. How about the cone? Any circular surfaces? Right here on the bottom, there's a circular surface. There's a circle down here at the bottom. There's a circle on the bottom of that cone. What about the cylinder? Any circular surfaces? Yes, on the top and on the bottom, it's a circle. Mm -hmm. We're going fast. Oh, they want us to draw the shape of the flat surface that these two shapes have. Okay, so that means we're not looking at the cube and we're not looking at the sphere. Good, because spheres don't have any flat surfaces. What about the cylinder and the cone? What surface do they both have that is flat? Because I know that they both have a round surface. Both of them can roll, but they also both have a circular surface. So I'm gonna make a circle right here. Which solids have the surface of a square? Which ones have the flat surface of a square? What do you think? Is it a cube? Is it a cone? Is it a, another cube? How about a cylinder? If you said cube, those do have a square face. If you said cone or cylinder, remember, the cone and the cylinder have a circular face. So I'm going to circle the two cubes because those have square faces. Oh, we've got a circle here. We're looking for a circular face. Does a cylinder have a circular face? Well, we've said it before, it does. So I'm going to circle the cylinder. What about the cone? Absolutely. What about the cube? No, sir. Here's the tricky one. What about the sphere? It looks just like the circle. Does the sphere have a flat circular surface? The answer is no, because the, the sphere has no flat surfaces. It's not flat on any spot. It is not flat. It is only round. So the sphere has no circular face. Okay, we're looking for squares again. Does the cone have a square? Quick. No. Does the cube have a square face? Quick. Yes. Does the cylinder have a square face? Quick. No. Does the cube have a square face? Quick. Yes, it does. Okay, here's what I want from you. Take your piece of paper, fold it in half, just like that, and open it up. We're going to make a square on this side and a circle on this side. See that? On the square side, I would like you to show me which shapes have a square face and which shapes have a circular face. Here's some examples for you. We have an ice cube. We have a cylinder, a can. We have a present, a Kleenex box, an ice cream cone, a party hat, a tennis ball, a tennis ball canister. And on this side, we have a pencil sharpener, a party hat, a funnel, a drum, a present, a Rubik's cube, a baseball, and a can of jam or jelly. You do not need to make me more than one shape. You can draw me one shape 
here that has a square surface and one shape here that has a circular surface. But remember, they need to look like solid shapes. Do you need me to show you how to draw some solid shapes? I'll give you a reminder. Here's how I draw a cube. Let's start with a square. Make a number seven and then connect, connect, connect. That's how we make a cube. Here's how we make a cylinder. Oval on top, two lines down, nice round bottom. That's how we make a cylinder. Okay, that's how we make a cube. Mountain, round, oh, that's not a cube. This is how we make a cone. Mountain, round bottom, cone with a magic E. Last one. This is how I draw a sphere. I make a circle and then I give it a shadow like this. And that is a sphere. Now you know how to draw the shapes. Pick one of the shapes to add to your square face and pick one of the shapes to add to your circular face. Sound good?